a huge part of your success, I know, was the time you spent in treatment, our good friends at Cliffside Malibu. That's, of course, the treatment center that you were at for, for the past five months. Dr. Damon Raskin, who is the center's chief medical advisor, is joining us. And just in a nutshell, tell us about her journey. It started out, you know, medically, uh, a brief period of detox and just getting her comfortable. And then she started with the uh, therapy, psychotherapy, uh, exercising, just getting her body in shape. Um, her blood tests were checked and showed continued improvement. And then spiritually, she is just, you know, a new person with new hope. And that's what I was hoping to be able to do with her is to take her from someone with no hope to someone who now has the future ahead of her. And I wish you all the best. You did such a great job. So Elizabeth, I know you're feeling good, right? Yes. You're excited to get back, spend time with your family. And you know, one of the unique things we've been talking a lot on the doctors about is, is aftercare. And anyone out there knows this, if you're addicted to something, it's not as though you one day wake up and you're, you're fine, it's over for good. This is a daily thing. So we reached out to Sydney Smith with Rise Center for Recovery. They're near your new home in Las Vegas. Oh, really? She's gonna give you one full year of therapy sessions oh, free. Oh so that you have all the tools that you need <laughs> to continue your sobriety. That's great. And we also want to say thank you to Royal Salon in nearby Beverly Hills, who graciously gave Elizabeth a brand new do this week to celebrate her sobriety. <laughs> Before you go, what are you most excited about? I'm ex most excited with my new journey with my ex-husband, future husband. <laughs> <laughs> My new life, I'm in school now. I started school while I've been in treatment, so I'm gonna be a health coach in less than a year. Nice. Good for you. Nice. Well, keep, it, keep us posted. Thank you. And Dr. Askin, thank you all so much for your diligent care. And David, for, for staying by Elizabeth through all of this. It, it just reminds us all that if you know someone that you love and they're struggling with addiction, reach out for help. You can also head to our website for more resources at thedoctorstv.com.